You got to play by the rules. So, of course, it's real. Hey, so this is the pro debut for this guy. Cam Redding in his first pro swing with a single to left field. One runs in. Here's a second. 2-0 Milwaukee. And the 23-year-old out of St. Louis University. First pro hit is this. Well, congratulations to Cam Redding. It's a big day. Obviously a local kid. First pitch he ever sees in pro ball. Laces one to left field and knocks in a pair to put his milkman up to here in the early goings. Boy, how often do you see that? You know, a guy gets gets signed to play pro ball. The juices are flowing and aggressive uh, approach at the, at the plate. And it pays off early here for Milwaukee. Got to say it. That's awesome. Product of New Trier High School in Wilmette. Went to St. Louis, one of the Billikens. Just graduated. Signed his first pro contract this morning. And a two-run single on his first swing. Now Hill lays off, takes a ball. Life's good now for Cam Redding. Hats off, too, to Justin Williams on the play. Very heads-up base run. He goes from first to third taking advantage of the extra base on the throw in from left field. Hill in a 1-1 after a swing and a miss. So Williams stands at third with only one away. And Redding it first. Dahlberg has given up his first couple runs against Milwaukee. Here in the second. Double play depth on the infield. And a fly ball foul. Bouncing back to the field. Sam, you remember your first professional game as a broadcaster? I do. I didn't hit a two-run single, though. Little jittery, maybe, though? Juices flowing a bit? Juices were flowing. It was really sweat inside of a hot dog suit. <laughs> <laughs> that was when we did the hot dog suit giveaway. Got in on the fun. And there's a line shot. And a diving Matt Botcher gets one out. Not two, but hey, one's enough on that hit. That got my juices flowing. Shot to second, good play by Botcher and a very heads up defensive effort to get up and make the toss to first to try to double off Redding. Good job by Redding to turn, locate that baseball behind him and scamper back to the first base bag in time to avoid being doubled off. So Brian Torres now, two outs, men on first and third. And a swing and a miss. 0-1, and he's 0-4-1. Flew out to left. Dahlberg just gave up a couple. And Torres called time. He's got to fix his batting gloves. Something we only see once per at bat now. Can only fix him so much. Have to utilize that timeout. That's... Uh the new gamesmanship element of the pitch clock era here in baseball. Torres with a half-hearted swing and a miss, 0-2. We usually see that step out, time out, batting glove thing with two strikes. Torres used it with one. Now it's 0-2, first and third and two out. It didn't go. Pitch was high. Ball one. Beefy as fastball of the afternoon so far from Dahlberg. Touch 90 on that one. Beefy. Let's see if he goes back to the beef. He checks on first. That's Redding. Milkman up two looking for a sweep against their rival dogs. Goes to the breaker, doesn't get that outside edge. Ball two. Great pitch choice there from Dahlberg. Don't see the slider as much, but on a one two, wants to try and fool the lefty Torres. Torres laid off, but pretty good location there and spot on the breaker nonetheless. Fights it off foul, still 2-2. Two -two. Torres is tough. Last year, 374 was the top average in the league. 
He's got great coverage of the plate. Hits with a wide open stance from that left-handed box, but leans over the plate with that slight crouch and is able to maneuver through the zone with ease. 2-2 two -two got him swinging. So Dahlberg finally strikes out Torres. Strands two on the corners, but the milkmen strike first.